I'm in the jungle right now. Welcome to the jungle! We got fun and games! You know. Dude, we got some sponge! Dude, I feel like I'm Magellan right now. I just open sea, nothing here. Marco! No. Why would... Why would he be saying Marco? It's another explorer. But they're not related, though. That's like going, mean? Neil what? Armstrong! What do you mean? One sailed around one thing, and the other one sailed around the other thing. But I'm talking about sailing around the ocean. Magellan like... went around Cape Horn, and Marco Polo went... To around... China. Yeah, to China. On land. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I just got blasted by light. <laughs> they both ended up in the similar place. Like, what if there's a guy named Todd Howard who is, like, into, like, crawling through caves? Like, you're not gonna just randomly bring him up. Yeah! Todd Howard makes games that involve you digging through caves a lot. Yeah, but, like, it's not- it doesn't make sense in the context of an explorer. What do you mean? Todd Howard makes games about exploring all the time! Okay, I shouldn't have- I shouldn't have used him as, like, a- uh, just a happenstance name. No, you name. shouldn't have. But, like, <laughs> it's still unrelated, though. Like, I'm not gonna bring up Skyrim if you're talking about Magellan. Like, if I- I, like, if- I, I don't think it'd be, like, too out of left field for me to go, like, Okay, calm down, Christopher Columbus, if you're like, I'm lost. Well, no, that 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 works perfectly because that's another sailor. The distinction between a sail an explorer on land versus an explorer on a boat is very small. I think you're making that distinction way bigger than it needs to be. Nah, I think they're very different. I I think you're wilding. <laughs> Dude, I'd love these wheat fields. We need to spread them out closer to the house, I think. We need to have roaming wheat fields. What do you mean by that? They like roam over hills. We need yeah. to make it look like um, we need to start a certain Eastern uh, European country that produced a lot of bread. You could just say Ukraine, I think. <laughs> you just want to make it look, look Ukraine esque. I don't think there's anything wrong with saying that. <laughs> I think it, I think it's only weird because you made it weird by <laughs> describing Ukraine in this weird roundabout way. Yeah. What about? Yeah. No. What if we made it look like this country that starts with a U and ends with an E? I and, and ends also with has a, like an A and an I. What, in it ends with a crane. Um, <laughs> it starts yeah. with U and ends with crane. You could have also used Kansas as an example, or Nebraska. Amber as waves of grain. From those states, Dude, I don't, like, I don't know things. why you went for Ukraine when amber waves of grain was literally right there. You should have been, you had a chance to be patriotic and you weren't. How dare you, sir? It's because I've been there. I've been in those fields, man. I've seen it first fucking hand. And, I <laughs> and tell I've you, been to the fields. Europe has oh, I've been to the beaches. <laughs> dude, dude, these RPG. I just got a legendary crate with a bunch of water breathing pro dude, potions. Dude, take that back. Get prisoners. that back here. Get that back here. Get dude, that back here. Hide it. Hide it. Hide it. You gotta hide it. You got Don't tell anybody oh, about it. Inventory is so fucking full, though. DL, 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 DL. Miss Clicks, if you're still watching, yeah, if you're, you're still, still in chat. You should keep. You should the fuck. You are now part of the secret triangle, and that is a that is a unbreakable vow. <laughs> like a Harry Potter. The secret triangle. <laughs> yeah. What, what is it's when three people share a secret. It's the you're you're part of the secret triangle. It's the triangle of secrets. Don't you mean chamber of secrets? No, that's a di you're. Look, I made one relation to Harry Potter. There's, that one relation to Harry Potter is the only Harry Potter relation that exists. Don't try to so, add more layers of Harry Potter connections. This is dude, five. Like this, is exactly this is in five what degrees we of Harry Potter. Fucking sailors. This is exactly the same thing. Bro, what the? F what is this spaceship Earth as? <laughs> oh, it's Final Fantasy, the main theme. Dude, <laughs> like, I'm telling like you, this, sometimes this, like, the music like, doesn't hit. I'm like, it's like this Epcot, this like Epcot Center entry music. Just, it's like you're giving me shit yesterday. Welcome to World Ooh. of Tomorrow. This is either going to look really good in scale or really bad in scale, and there's no real way to tell yet. So that kind of makes me a little nervous. What's your vote, Mason, Out of, without seeing it? Without seeing it? 
<laughs> you think it's gonna be good or you think it's gonna be bad? Uh, bad. Yo, let me collect the food I was cooking. I don't need to eat quite yet. As much as Mason would have us believe otherwise. But that's just, um, he's just been bought by the food corporations. And so he's just covering for them. Just the Minecraft Trying ones, IRL. I don't do, I don't eat anything. Like, I eat two meals a day is a good day for me. JDM Blackout, post-capitalist confirmed. America! Doesn't yeah. matter, as long as you're on top. Um, Fact. It's like that quote in um, Journey to the Center of the Earth when Brendan Fraser is talking to PETA from the Hunger Games. Um, when did he and talk he's with like, the he's people? Like, he's like, you know, money's not the only thing that matters, Sean. People matter too. And then PETA from the Hunger Games goes, not if you have a Maserati. <laughs> and it do be like that. When did he say that in the Hunger Games? It wasn't in the Hunger Games. It was a Journey to the Center of the Earth. Also, is that you shooting an arrow? At? Okay. Why wouldn't you say... Uh... Josh Hutchman. Jo Josh Hutchman. Yeah. <laughs> the fine Josh Hutchman. Oh, that's such a good. I, I, I think that should be his name. Well, I think he should legally change it. it. He should mm -hmm. legally change it to Josh Hutchman. It would be funny is if legally you had to get your mom to change her name, regardless <laughs> of like any reason or what. You just had to have your mom do it. So. Just make a bunch of awkward situations. I think I might be pro that. <laughs> I'm not sure I would be pro that. <laughs> I think that's kind of funny. Well, it's funny, but I'm not sure it's a good idea. I don't care. I think it's funny. I think it's funny enough that it doesn't really matter. <laughs> uh, they should make it to when you put gunpowder in the furnace, it explodes. So it's like yes. timed. You can have it where it's... Yes. Yeah, like timer. in Jason Bourne. Not Jason Bourne, Bourne Identity. <laughs> okay. Or no, it was uh, Bourne Supremacy. You don't remember that? He's... I don't know what you're... In Bourne Supremacy, I think it's towards either towards the beginning or towards the end. He's being like chased by people and he goes into a house and he fills it up with gas and then puts the magazine in the toaster oven. In like the toaster. And then by the time the bad guys get there, the toaster, the magazine catches fire and blows the house up. You don't remember that? Dude, it's been eons since I've seen Jason Bourne. Mythbusters tested it. It doesn't cool. work. Why the f did we annex the sugarcane farm? I don't know, actually. Yeah, that pissed me <laughs> off the other day. Like, dude. I think I like meant to redo it, but like forgot. <laughs> Dude, it. I think. Oh, okay. It looks like we added what, another no, row. Yeah, that's what it was. Because I added this other row of wheat, and I meant to like replace it, but I just think I forgot to replace it by the time I was done adding the extra row. Well, of wheat. you know, what? in your defense, I probably saw that stack of sugar cane and just immediately converted it into paper. paper <laughs> so it's half your full. Well, it's not really half my full. I should assume that our money maker crop isn't in the storage chest dude, and instead it should be out there dude you know what they say i don't know where i'm going with that i fell on a spider ah ah okay uh sword uh get eat it uh your mom damn it dude i'm so bad at just walking off of scaffolding you're not normally supposed to walk off scaffolding. I know. Trust me, I know. Unlike them, I don't fly now. <laughs> I was more caught up in the, the pronoun and just how like out of context you're like, unlike them. I knew it wouldn't make sense until the second just point. Zero context. But you knew exactly what I was talking about. Well, you can't just say they fly now and, and <laughs> they fly of now. Of course, I'm gonna get it. <laughs> okay, Jonah, you can live in a video game world for the rest of your life. Skyrim. Why would you choose Skyrim? I don't need to hear the rest. It's Skyrim. <laughs> That's like, but you're gonna be. You're not gonna be like the main character. You Skyrim. just live in that world. So you're gonna be like the poorest king Khajiit ever. And no. I'd yeah, you, you're not gonna shit. in that. What? 
Says who? You, don't get a, you don't get a choice in how you're born into that world. You just um, live in that world. People will decide to, like, fuck off and become bounty hunters all the time in that game. Also, anybody's welcome to join the Fighters Guild or the Companions. So if I could learn how to... if I would just need to learn how to do, like, fight something. I wouldn't need to be the main character. What if you're the like, only Khajiit who's unable to walk? <laughs> I mean, you can't, because you took an arrow so, to me. your stipulation is, I get to live in Skyrim, but I have to be a Khajiit who's a disabled veteran. <laughs> no, 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 I'm not saying that you have to be. I'm just saying you could be, and you I don't know that. I could be. You could yeah, be even I worse. could be. <laughs> it could be even worse. Yeah, but it could be awesome. Yeah, you could be the main character, or you could be the the guy who gets melted by the dragon in, like, the first second of the game. Nah, I'd be a hunter. Yeah, you'd be hunted. <laughs> you're like being so deranged right now. I don't know why you assume you get to pick who you get to be in this world. I didn't say I would, but you're trying, you're trying like... to pick. You're trying to pick for me. <laughs> no, I'm not saying that you would end up as the disabled Khajiit. I'm just saying that there's a chance of that happening. So you could, I mean, but you could also just be a poor, you know, unhealthy, like, farmer. So, like, so, but like, so what's the point? Like, it's just like real life. You're just saying you think about so, like, it? Yeah, that's what like... I mean. Just like real life. You have all these options of video games where you could pick a world that was like, okay. And then you picked one that was extremely realistic. You're right, Mason. The game with dragons, cat people, and lizard men is extremely real realistic. Yeah. You know what I'd pick? Wii Sports Resort. <laughs> See? What, what if you're See? disabled? No, you can't be disabled in that game. Anybody yes, you can! can. <laughs> Anybody can play. Name one disabled me. Nope, there are none. Because they don't have arms or legs. <laughs> they get around fine. <laughs> what? It's just... It's just so deranged. I don't even saying, know. Like, you you picked even... poorly. <laughs> you could be the Jarl, and then you just sit in the chair, and then the fucking dragon feel, comes and feel, saves your ass. I feel like you had all of this planned. <laughs> you know, you had every single thing planned. I feel like no matter what game I picked, you're gonna be like, what if you were, what if you couldn't walk? Okay, and then you were gonna game. pick Wii Sports Resort because they don't have legs. <laughs> Pick another game. <laughs> I can't breathe. I need to like, I need to like take a moment. <laughs> I don't have the wherewithal for your deranged bits. It's, what you, I don't know what you're talking about. I was just a genuine question. I was super curious what you'd pick. And, and then. But you like just went kinda... super out of left field with it, like immediately. Like. <laughs> well, no, what, I mean, how else would that conversation go though? I don't know any other way. I mean, you could have said Pong, and I would have to, like, like completely rework that question. Like, I'd be so confused. Yeah, but I don't want to live in Pong. No, I know you don't. But, I mean, I'm also not convinced you want to live in Skyrim. Yeah. Because you could be disabled. <laughs> Dude, you don't have- that's not how you- It's because you're distracting me with your insanity! <laughs> okay, what if you woke up one day, and you were like, yeah, Red Dead is the place to be. Miss Clicks actually saved you from another stupid hypothetical. <laughs> <laughs> dude, like, like dude, key. dude, can we please do a different bit? Like, please, can we do, like, any other bit than, like, deranged hypotheticals? I'm, uh, like, try- I'm too, like, I am building something. I don't have time to, like, think. If you, Especially if you're gonna be deranged. <laughs> Okay, but okay, wait. You want a non-deranged hypothetical, or do you? Want I don't want to... any hypothetical. <laughs> I want a different category of bit entirely. I okay. We're looking this up. I'm trying to build something. Can you see northern lights in the south? Um, no. You see southern lights. Do they actually call them southern lights? No. I'm pretty sure you can only see them in Antarctica, and nobody lives there. You don't know that. I do know that. Nobody lives there on a permanent basis. It's just no a rotating team. It's, it's rotating teams of scientists. Okay, yeah, I, I'm not even counting the penguins. I don't think There's the no... penguins look up at the sky and go, look, the southern lights or the northern lights, either way. <laughs> yeah. 
I don't think they look up at the sky and say anything. Those I'm are doubtful. my kind of penguins. I am doubtful they... that penguins have the capability to look up at the sky. Dude, you don't know that. You shouldn't doubt. Actually, the penguins. no, they do because they do that thing. <laughs> they, they dress up. They they are they are dapper dans, and you're over here like sitting on their brains. I'm not you're sitting on their brains. Races. I'm sitting on their lack of opposable thumbs. So thumbage is a determiner of knowledge and wealth. And status in the world is that what you're saying yes you lose your thumb you lose all value as a person <laughs> oh. i don't know how to explain that to the armless person in cooking sim or just like anybody who's lost a thumb for any multitude of reasons it's like yeah dude my work dude, didn't so give a shit about worker safety so i lost my thumb in an accident it's like oh well you're not valuable as a person. <laughs> so what you're saying is, is Floop is Jesus Dude, what, and the thumb you, thumbs are you, are angels? Are you, the, are you a BBC news reporter? Like, what is... <laughs> so, well, so what you're saying is... Shut the f*** up. No, I you totally I'm not on a British morning show right I now. Said, yeah, I okay. did, because I am opposed to the premise with which you're asking the question. <laughs> Bruh, I just made an association and you murdered it. It's fine. That's cool. I'm kind of curious what the association is. Oh, well, now I, I kind of don't want to tell you. I, to I did totally miss it. You totally did, dude. <laughs> no you one said, just says Floop is you Jesus said... and then doesn't get to finish it. <laughs> is, that, is that what you I said? can't believe that's what you cut me off on. Oh my gosh. And I, I called feel... the thumb thumbs as like biblically, ac biblically, biblically accurate angels because they're. Oh my gosh, I creatures. can't believe I cut that off. That's an amazing I know. Bit. Deranged, he calls me. <laughs> Dude, you can't say floop is Jesus and then be like, I can't believe you called me deranged. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe you cut me off. All I heard was, so what you're saying is, and then you know, turned it out. You, you do me. <laughs> you immediately cut me off. Dude, I think my dad has Curse of Vanishing. <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing. Um, no, it's not. I mean, um, like, it's not amazing for you, but it's an amazing, like, as a sentence. Oh, that's why I said it, because my dad's actually, um, <laughs> he's actually got mending. <laughs> my dad is the self-healing model. It's like, uh, robots, you know, you can get upgrades, people. Yeah. What model of dad do you have? <laughs> Xbox off. I don't know why. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> now I'm deranged. <laughs> now I am. <laughs> That was, that was like the voices like took over. That wasn't me. <laughs> so we putting animals in here? Yeah, this will be the animal pin. So there's gonna be room for six stalls, two for each type of animal. Where are the um, donkeys gonna go? We're gonna build. They'll be a separate stables. Okay, so you don't keep stables. the horses with the cows. Everyone knows that. Um. Yeah, you do. I need more dark wood. <laughs> I'm so glad that worked. They should have Jordan Peterson play Toad in the Mario movie. Well, Mario, the problem with you is you haven't cleaned your room. That's why the princess <laughs> keeps getting taken away. If you had a clean room, maybe you'd be there to protect her. <laughs> <laughs> See, Mario, you need to become a monster, and then you gotta tame yourself, and then you can defeat Bowser. <laughs> <laughs> Done. <laughs> You keep Dude. talking about whether or not you want to wrestle, you want to rescue the princess Mario, but I think you should really be rescuing yourself. <laughs> You're just rescuing the princess because that's what the woke moralists want you to do. <laughs> How is this not more deranged than my Kaji with no arms bit? <laughs> I will call out work tomorrow if you kill Dave right now. <laughs> Which is a lie. That's a big incentive. That's a huge incentive. And I really can't do that because yeah. my work is on fire. Like, it, like, if my job was a singular building, it would be completely on fire right now. If my job was a singular building, it wouldn't be a building. <laughs> <laughs> These sheep need to shut the f*** up. Me okay. on Twitter. Dude, okay. Your barn... Looks like the logo for Lucky Strike. <laughs> yes. Which is kind of oh, dude, we gotta get a tobacco farm. We gotta do that. I. We. I mean, there's no. This is a game for children, so there's no tobacco <laughs> plant. But we could imagine. Even though 
Um, I think there should be tobacco plants in Minecraft because lest we forget, tobacco was the cornerstone of our great nation's economy. And I think it's a shame that people have forgotten this. Anyway. When I talk about the Civil War, he's like, I don't know what you're talking about, random obscure American history. And then he just goes on the spew of like how great a specific economic product was. I mean, it was. No, it was. I high key agree with you. I think it's bad that they're banned. It was literally great are. for everybody. Hey, friend. Is that, you want to fight him? If you want to. I'm going to fight him. <laughs> I didn't see any of that. I just heard the noise and got the message. We need stuff to keep the bugs away. The spiders have already killed you once. They've killed me more than once, dude. That's been like a fairly regular a reoccurring um, battle. Nightmare, nightmare, nightmare. It's like that Cody Ko song, dude. What song? Ow. Bro, bro, get, <laughs> get. I'm looking down. I accidentally took your melons and bread. I want the bread back. Yeah, I'll give you, I'll give you the bread back. Just looking down. Don't mind me, Mr. Enderman's song. Dude, how are we gonna survive this winter? It's already summer, and we don't even have crops grown yet. Um, we pray. We pray resort. <laughs> we pray. <laughs> <laughs> I think we just need to end it. <laughs> It was the end stream. <laughs>